Now, your Chris 6 weather forecast with meteorologist Bill Alexander. Looking for love in all the electronic places. Well, it was a lovely weekend around here with mainly clear skies, mild temperatures, a beautiful night, and we've got another great one going on right now. Take a look at your weather bug out at Beeville where we've got 89 degrees with that east and southeast wind at 11 miles an hour. Clear skies, just looking great out there. We made it all the way up to 83 here at Corpus Christi International after a mild low of 67. Unfortunately, three, about 4.6 inches below normal in rainfall. We really need some. It's going to be a couple of days before we have an opportunity for that. Look at this right now. Mainly clear skies across the southern part of the Lone Star State. There were a couple of showers this morning offshore that moved away from us. Weak little upper level disturbance. No impact around here. And in its wake, we've got temperatures mainly in the 80s to around 90 degrees there at Del Rio across the state. And locally, a cool spot there, Port Aransas, 78 degrees. Water at Port Malachi, out at Malachi Beach is 79 degrees. 80s elsewhere across the region. And the big difference there, the dew point in the interior is still fairly low in the 40s and 50s, but we've recovered to the lower, even middle 60s along the coastline. You'll see that trend continue in the coming couple of days. And by Tuesday, we're going to see that uh, dew point all the way back in the stifling area around the middle 70s. So prepare yourself for the inevitable return of moisture. And that's because this warm front backing over us is introducing that deep tropical moisture back into the region. And uh, we're setting ourselves up for a little bit of midweek shower activity. Could be more beneficial than uh, originally thought. So let's keep an eye on that one. And that's the good news because we do need the rain. Now you do see one or two showers around here on your Tuesday afternoon. I think most of that will stay to the north of us. But by Wednesday, it all comes to play around here. Uh, during the day Wednesday, showers and thunderstorms will be scattered across the area as a fairly strong disturbance moves across that uh, moist and slightly unstable air mass. But by Thursday, it all clears out and it's looking awfully nice as you move into your Friday. But Friday, it's going to be a scorcher with that high pressure overhead moving across, lifting us into the lower 90s. Looking pretty nice over the weekend. We might see a shower or two late on your Sunday. So, uh, with that in mind, how much rain are we looking at? And we're going to be seeing uh, rainfall accumulate pretty nicely during the day on your Wednesday, especially points north. Uh, Refurio about two-thirds of an inch, a uh, quarter to a half inch elsewhere across uh, the central part of the Texas coast, basically from Valfurias on up to uh, portions of the coastal bend. So pretty nice little rain dousing there on your Wednesday. It clears out for Thursday, though. As we move on into the next couple of uh, uh, days, we'll start off with mainly clear skies tonight. Temperatures dropping into the upper 60s before rising on that southeasterly flow on into the lower, perhaps even middle 80s as you move on into uh, the mid-afternoon tomorrow. Again, uh, the midweek rain and thunderstorms will be scattered across the area. Uh, a lot of heat coming up towards the end of the week, so prepare yourself for lower 90s by Friday. Follow.